TV. Never been a fan of shooting sticks, maybe apart from tripods. But um, Blas came up with something last year that did impress me, and they've sent me one through. You probably saw it at the old shooting sports, I did a, a paper review of it. Well, here it is, the Blaser carbon stick. The first thing you notice, it comes in a rather nice little carry case, so you can sling it over your shoulder. And it's four poles hinged at the bottom. I imagine you could call it reverse bipod. Uh, all made of carbon fibre, which is really nice and light. I think all up weight's just about two and a half pounds. Um, as it is, strapped together, it makes a good walking stick. If you're up in Scotland, going over the peat hags and up hills where someone of my age and weight needs a stick, it's not bad. So, comes with a retention strap here. Let's pop it off. And all you do, unclip this, like so, and get it off. Which I can't, there we are, sorry, a bit strong there. And you can see you've got basically two V's like this. The, these V legs are locked with rotary collars, marked open and closed, which is quite nice. And what you do, you actually match them gate, and you can bring it up, pull it out to whatever height you want. And it can get quite high, but say for me, I'm I'm 6'2, so I'd be about here with it, I think roughly so just lock that back in like that bring up the other one to about there lock it in same this side lock it in I'm about right for height there So you've basically got the big V. At the back, it's a simple fork that accepts the butt uh, in any way you like, right at the back or, be or behind, it doesn't matter. Um, the front is more interesting because it's got a handle, which is a clever idea. But making it even clever is the handle rotates, and that rotates for a reason. You can, as you can see when we actually put the thing in and start shooting it, you're on the stick, and the worst thing about sticks is something comes along and you're just literally you're pointing in one direction. You can certainly move the stick like that. You can almost walk it in position if you want to, but that can be a bit of a pain and also slow. But with this thing, if you watch my hand, literally, gun's held at the back, you tilt your hand, and the front fork will obviously rotate with the rifle, but you can cover, as you can imagine, a lot of ground. I think at, at 100 meters, you can cover, I think it's about 30 or 40 degrees, which is about 25, 30 meters, I think. But that's good. So if you see a deer and he walks out and he's walking, then he stops and you can get on him quite quickly. Um, so it's adjustable. And this is nice. This is the standard forks so for any rifle. My blazer, I've got a blazer carbon bipod, the one that plugs into the fore end. And it's got a special replacement fore end with a socket to make them at their Spartan type design. You can get put this back in the bag and you can put in a spigot that goes in that hole so even better but I found oddly enough though a big blazer r8 fan I found I prefer the fork to the spigot but that's just me so basically and it can it can come together like this and it can make a tall walking pole if you want to um, say so, not a fan of this system usually but I'm a bit won over by it price wise I think they're 243 pounds which for something from Blaza, I'm not trying to be trite here, is a pretty good price. And it's a solid product, come to the bag, and uh, just like to thank Frederick from uh, Blaza Group Limited um, for the loan of these lovely sticks. Hi, back again with my R8 in 243 on the carbon stick. Um, as you can see, the rear fork can be slid to there, to there, right to the back, it's entirely what you want to do with it. So, and you can also rock with the thing, which is quite nice, you can see. Just roll and, again, watch the barrel. You'll probably see it tracking. And it's certainly useful. Um, I say you can put the spigot on if you want to. Also, I've found that for quick change of movement, if something you really need to shift position quickly, you can quickly lift up a leg and literally 
do that with it. I know you can with other sticks, but the fact it's got blade feet means you can just go wet. You back in and back out. Plus, if you need to adjust your height to a degree, you can move the legs together or bring them apart. So I actually use this sitting with all the legs folded up and, it, and it's equally as, equally as effective. So let's just see it in use. If I'm just standing there without a stick, I'm in an open place because I'm not very good at shooting unsupported. Laser carbon stick and my trusty R8. For the money, build quality, hell of a piece of kit. See you later.